It is a medical miracle that's the first of its kind in the world, and it's happened right here in Memphis. Fahad Khan was uh, given a procedure that allows him to hear out of both sides, uh, thanks to Dr. Paul Shea from the Shea Clinic. And when I say both sides, correct me if I'm wrong, you had single side hearing loss, right? Yeah, uh, it was in November last year. Mm -hmm. uh, one night I woke up and uh, suddenly there was a noise in my ear, uh, ringing in my ear and uh, I lost my hearing. Wow. So uh, by, by the time I woke up the, in the morning, it was all gone. It was, it had a, I had a profound hearing loss. So I went to my ENT uh, doctor in the morning and he said, yeah, this is a sudden hearing loss. And uh, in most of the cases, the hearing comes back, but it may not come back as well. So uh, I went through the regular uh, steroid therapy and whatever. And but it didn't uh, make any difference. So, uh -huh. so what brought about the big change? Uh, how did you find out about the procedure that you eventually had? So, uh, a friend of mine who lives in Memphis, he told me about the Shea Clinic. Mm -hmm. So I uh, and he uh, told me to visit them. So I visited Dr. Paul Shea in February. So he said that uh, yes, the hearing is gone, but and uh, now uh, it's a window of about 10 days if the hearing comes back it's okay but after 10 to 15 days it's not it's possible not yeah. now dr shea is a cochlear implant we've heard about that for years you guys have done that for years but not usually with single side hearing why not and and why is it you know why were you willing to try what other doctors weren't well uh, cochlear implantation has been around for about 30 years it was approved in the united states for profound deafness in 1984 right uh, but only for patients who were deaf in both ears. So uh, it was believed that if a patient had hearing in one ear that they could get by, and, and they can, but they have a lot of difficulty, mm -hmm. particularly around noise, um, in conversations, if there's more than one person talking to them, or if anybody is on their deaf side. They, okay. they really do struggle and have quite a difficult time. Cochlear implants work beautifully for patients who are profoundly deaf in both ears. But it was believed that if you had normal hearing in the other ear, that, and, and then you received a cochlear implant in your deaf ear, that the hearing with the cochlear implant is so different that, that fr from normal hearing that you're, you wouldn't like it or your brain wouldn't be able, your to, brain wouldn't be able to accept the, the new signals. Why? So, Fahad, what was the experience like when yeah. you, obviously the procedure was a success and then you're able to hear out of both ears. What was it like for you? Yeah, I was really delighted. And uh, the, although the hearing was a bit different from what I hear from the good ear, but uh, I have researched on the internet, so uh, the brain will start recognizing this electrical signal. But I'm certainly very, very glad to hear from my deaf ear. You've been traveling for a couple of weeks around the states. Any yeah. any challenges, or would you say this this operation has has vastly improved? Yeah, it, it, it has vastly improved, and I'm really very happy. That's so, great. Yeah, yeah. So the shake Thanks line leads the doctor. way. You think other yeah. doctors will begin to do this? Well, it's it's uh, it's being done in some clinical trials around the country, okay. but uh, uh, and it's been done in Europe before. But this is certainly the first one in of this States. sort of operation in the Mid South, and and um, okay. one of the very first in the United States. All right, Excellent. gentlemen, thank you. We appreciate you being here. Thank you. Thank you. All right, coming up next.